Copper has exceptional formability. It can be bent with a simple hand tool, employing mandrels, dies, forms, and fillers, or power-operated bending machine can be used. Both annealed tube and hard-drawn tube can be bent with appropriate hand benders. The proper size of bender for each size tube must be used. Today, I will be talking about the procedure for bending copper tube. There are several types that can be used, like a spring bender, a ratchet bender, but I'll be using a lever type hand bender. With the handles at 180 degrees and the tube holding clip lifted out of the way, insert the tube in the forming wheel groove. Place holding clip over the tube and bring the handle into the approximately right angle position, engaging the forming shoe over the tube. The serial mark on the forming wheel should then be even with the front edge of the forming shoe. Bend by pulling handle towards each other in a smooth, continuous motion. The desired angle of the bend will be indicated by the calibration on the forming wheel. Remove bend tube by pivoting the handle to a right angle with the tube, disengaging the forming shoe, and release the tube holding clip. This is how to bend with just one of the available tools, and instructions for each method from the tool manufacturer should be followed.